What's up guys? It's Bro back here. And we are going back into some more Don't Starve Mod Mash. So, we are back. Um, I'm looking around trying to decide what we need to do today. I don't remember. It's been a minute or two since I've played. Um, I'm just trying to fill out this map right here. Looking firstly, we're still a good way just starting in the autumn. So I'm not too, too worried about setting up for winter quite yet. We still need to get our base a little bit more defended. Um, we did a good amount of, um, not exploration last time, but gathering, which is very important um, to keeping our base stocked. But we still need a well of rot or poop or however we want to do it to um, provide the nourishment for our plant. Um, so I'm trying to think of the best way to do that. Uh, additionally, we are not the best on food right now. Uh, we have two berries to our name and 63 hunger. So I was kind of looking around seeing if we had any rabbits or dens or opportunities on our island. We do have a lot of grassland here. However, it is just stone um, and tall bird. So lays eggs, that could be an option. We could just take that tall bird egg. Um, would be one that's easy. Hatch it into a tall bird who we can then eat. Possibly. Time for a snack. I know, man. They're hungry. So I am going to snag this and let them try to catch me. Uh, I don't think they can. I don't think you'll be able to catch me if I continue running. Um, but that'll sustain us for a little bit. We'll make it some kind of egg dinner tonight. Um, and he should shed off more. Um, eggs since we have the drop mod. Um, I don't know how often he will be doing that So I don't want to depend too much on that Looking around uh, the wildlife in the area is fairly sparse um, Nothing too crazy our spider friends are still developing so nothing there. We have the berries up here a bit of silk everywhere Yeah, they're just shedding like crazy, um, but I can't think of any traps we can make using the silk. Uh, we could catch bees and do bee houses um, is an idea I've currently had um, but at the same time we have to break the bees down. Uh, we need the, the hives not just the bees themselves. Um, we can get a lot of butterflies which I think can be turned into butter so a flower farm could be something we think about doing releasing them which would keep our sanity really high um, but again that's not our current concern um, those are just ideas I've had with like the general advantages we can look up I was wanting to also look if we had any easily accessible lobster dens um, the lobsters are great um, and with the excess of silk the deep sea fishing rod would be tremendous but I don't think we have any, yeah, there'd be great if there's one right along our strip of beach. There's one up and over here. That's the only one I'm seeing. And we could maybe just make a fishing spot here as an a alternative for now. Um, but with the tall burger egg, I think we will be okay for tonight. We'll grab some more of these feathers and make use of those. I really need like one more ingredient. Oh no, I got three berries. Let's see what we can make out of just what we have. Um, additionally, another option could just be going ahead and setting up planting. I'm not like super excited about that. Uh, the animation looks a little broken right now. I don't know if I'm actually cutting anything. I am. Um, but I don't know if that's really the route I wanna go with. The planting takes quite a while. I mean, I guess it'd be better now than later in the year. Um, the don't start beer but at the same time I'm not like excited for it I also think I want to set up an additional campfire so we can work in more than one place at once maybe making this plot of land over where I'm standing now a kind of food zone be kind of nice and then leave this as our like crafting area and cooking Just kind of split it up I don't think there's a downside to doing that um, but I do want to clear out some of this vagrant land um, our forest up here. The bushes. Oh no, I don't want to dig that. Uh, I want to grab that feather. Yeah, I got like that there. So let's set up. I 
think I'll leave these two trees for now. Let's cut down these. I will let these fall one grass. Let's look and see. Let's go ahead and set up a, a garden rigmarole. Um, so we need some rope. I, uh, no, it's for fine. Two rope. Thanks. And what else? Uh, three boards. Do I have the wood for that? I got the wood for that. I can spare that. Because we'll get four uses out of it. And the crop fields, I don't think, go away. Four. And boom. Oh, we already had one. It was only three. Whoops. Ooh, that's not good. I don't know if that can hit our base. It, it's good to note that we'll have a better supply of stone and gold. Oh, it can hit our base. It hits everywhere around it. That might be bad for us. Overall. It didn't hit anything important, it looks like, but I might want to move stuff up and around. So here it. Did it take out? No. It broke two tufts of grass. Easily replantable. Okay. Um, I also need to get some food going. All right, what can we do with this? Boom. Bag of jam. Oh, 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 oh. Not really what I wanted to use, but I couldn't find my logs. Two of those, we should be good. Is that really all I can make with this tall bird egg? I figured there'd be something better. Um, I need more meat, it looks like, maybe? Yeah, pierogi. Yeah, maybe if I cook it first, see what I can make with it. Because, yeah, I definitely need something to eat here. <laughs> Down to seven. If I do that, and then all three of these. Boom. Still a handful of jam. I'm just going to eat this then. Probably not the best. And then we'll put these three in here. And a stick. Like one stick. Oh, that's just what you can I put a seed? Seed in here? Nope, can I cook one and throw it in there? I just want a filler if I can get one. Um Nope, can't. I can't cook this. Okay then. This cookies are yeah, our food situation. A bit dire. I mean Talbaric egg was nice, but at the same time, won't last forever. Okay. Yeah, let's get to work in. Let's get this thing rigmarole and we got the seeds to do it pretty well, so. Let's go do it. And I think we will try making that fish rod. I have tons of um, webbing and spider silk, so I don't see a reason not to not do it. And we gotta prepare for winter. I mean, food's gonna be scarce. We don't have an ice box yet. So, let's try it. Right, there's our pine cones. There's a little bit more space. Trying to keep our base a little more tidy. Not always the best at that, so. Right, let's go pick up our garden. And then we should be able to plant it here. Pick up these. We need to make a hoe, which means we need twigs, so. Let me keep that in mind. Oh, there's one right there. Do we have any available for us right now? Based on just our stuff. We also should make sure nothing else got destroyed it over here. Good. No, nothing too bad. New stone piles here, which again will fuel our stone economy, which is kind of nice. Um, but we just have to watch out for it later on. Could be bad later. And I don't know if they just continuously hit the same place. Um, I'm just kind of making the assumption that they won't, but I could be wrong. Pick up the garden. What to pick up? It's back. Give me this is what I wanted. Um, I think one of our mods we did install um, did change up how this worked and will automatically align them, which is great because the fact that you can like, yeah, get off on the tilling kind of is annoying. So I did have that thing installed now. And we're gonna do a full crop build. We got plenty of seeds. Do as many as we can here. See what we grow. We'll want a composter still. Okay, uh, put this away. Let's get this going again. And all that kind of good jazz that we were using last time. 
And boom. That's good. Where's my hoe back at? Let's take a little bit of durability off of it every time I do this. Like more than I would expect. Here. Alright, so not too bad. Um uh, that one. One plot of nine there, and we got twenty-six, so let's really really place them down. Oh, you can't. Alright, plant. You think that they would, uh, like, you could hold uh, space to automatically plant. And there might be a key for it. But I don't know it off the top of my head. I want to start getting these in the ground. Maybe set up a campfire nearby so we can at night talk to the plants. You gotta, you gotta do, I think that gives you a better chance for bigger plants. Not 100% sure, but I think that's part of it. That. This. Shovel. And there is a chance you get good stuff out of these. Little vagrant spots that you're di you dig up. Oh. Put that. I'm going to till some of these other pieces. Two. Three. Four. And five. I don't think you want to leave unplanted stuff. I think that can cause weeds. Not 100% sure on that, but sounds right. Okay. Unequip this and go ahead and talk to all the plants that I can right here. Give them some good company. I love the things that he says. Okay. Not too bad. And maybe, yeah, I think I'll look at the deep sea rod why we are taking our little nap time break. Well, we don't sleep, but same preference. Our preference. Okay. I wish there was also an icon that showed when you've talked to them or they changed color possibly. I think I've talked to most of them, but I can't really, not a good way to tell. Okay. More feathers. I don't know what I'm doing with all these, but I keep collecting them. I mean, it's like, if you don't, it's wasting. Let's see. Ooh, oh no, this would be survival, I assume. So, bird trap, uh, we can make easily. So, we can eat birds. Bug net would be easy. Oh, sea fishing rod. That's one of the ones. There we go. And I think you need, like, twigs and bait and stuff to really take advantage of this. But, this is a start. More than we have now. So, like it. Let's see if we can get a fish before nighttime. I don't know if we can or not. And I also want to grab a couple twigs. Ours have not grown yet, so our supply is dangerously low. Okay, can I just... Yeah, I can just cast onto here. I don't know how you... Oh, it's just right-click the reel. I don't know if you have to be on a school of fish. I assume so, now that I'm thinking about it. Okay. Yeah, I assume that's what we'll need. We'll have to find some fishes for casting. Okay, keep that in mind. I don't know if there's any... Oh, yeah, right right here. Yeah. Come on. Come on. Okay. Interesting. Yeah, this is going to take some practice, though. I don't know how to tell if they get on it or not. Yeah, they're, they're interested, but I can't... Oh, we did get one! Awesome! Food for tonight. Hunger, murder. I mean, yeah, we're just gonna murder it. Cool. So there's gonna be our more plentiful source of food. There are only fish morsels, and it's gonna take me a bit of time to figure out the best way, but that is sustainable food. And as we get better at it, um, we should be able to do lobsters. Go ahead and cook this. All right, sweet. 19, back up to 32. Go ahead and grill these seeds too. Nice. Alright. I think we'll do another day here. Yeah, I'm gonna have to go get more food. But this thing has infinite durability. So we should keep this around with us as we travel um, to continuously pick up fish and stuff. Um, and then we can dry them, would be the overarching goal. And um, continue it that way. A normal fishing rod, go fishing for fish. 
could be worth having. Does this one have a durability? It does. Okay. Ooh, I know what I want to do too. Is we wanted to make frog traps. We have not went and checked our frogs. I think we've already crafted one and left it over there. So we gotta keep that in mind. Um, we go and open my large chest. Let's put some of our stuff in here. Got a good selection of things, Snyder. All right, let's go and check actually our frog traps. I forgot we set those out last time. Oh, all our crops are looking so good. Got that green thumb going. Let's look over here. We also need some more pathing through here, but last, I'm not too worried about it. Ugh. Health is our, our downside right now, but if we can get that solved, we'll be in business, I think. We need to pick up twigs while we're out. We need a ton of them. Um, they are up here. Okay. Let's see if I was correct on my assumption. I think I was. That you can catch frogs in these traps. You can, and there's the frog legs to prove it. Ow. Okay, so I just want to set the trap here. Let's grab the stuff and make some more. So we do have to remember that the frogs are still mean. Um, but we'll hang this one up to dry, or we'll just eat it right out. Uh, but I think we can grab enough random stuff to make a few more traps. It would be great, yeah. And that'll help supplement our increasingly terrible food sources. Um, and once we get some of those drying, that'll also um, assist in that. We're going to need a lot of um, rot to get our um, continued supply of... Traps made though. Alright, let's drop this a little closer up in here. Man, this is a nightmare for for me who do not want to fight with the frogs. Okay, there we go. As we just continue around. They do attack slow. So they are hard to they're not gonna hit you immediately. But it's gonna be like checking these traps. Like boop! Okay. I can walk around, set the trap again, and continue along. All right, <laughs> and that's all you get. And then you hope that one of them jumps into it while you kind of walk around here. But that will eventually thin it out to where, um, ow, crap. I didn't think if I'm continuously running, they would get a hit in, really, if I'm being honest. That one over here. I thought that I could outrun them faster than they could hit me. Nice to know, but hopefully I can thin them down because this is a little much. Okay. Okay. There we go. Alright. Go get some more live bait or some more um, grass to do this with. Because yeah, they're everywhere. But this will be good for us. Eat something. Keep my hunger a little higher. Because it's getting a little rough. Try and get these saplings too over down here. A bit necessary, since ours have not grown yet. We're also exploring a little bit of new area. Which never hurts. I can see some more berry bushes. That would also... Or carrots. I feel like we haven't seen a lot of those. Bees. Uh, continue eating these seeds down. Munch, munch, munch. I know they don't, probably suck. Okay. Can I get some of this grass without a frog trying to eat my face off? Yes, that's the answer. Okay. Down here and craft another one of these. Oh, there's a berry bush over there. I, again, I want more frogs. We got three out of this little venture. Okay. Let's see if any of these have already sprouted more frog legs. Because this will be great for us. Alright. Um, oh, they all go back to their ponds at night. So this is the time to come check these babies. And to reset them up. Good to know. I didn't know that, honestly. Eleven. Eat this. Yeah, we're going to have a good... Hopefully a good meal tonight. Maybe, like, cook two frog legs or something. I don't remember what all you need to make. Like a frog... Froggy Brunwich? Uh... Is the technical one that you want to eat? Oh, and there's some berries too. Those and carrots. Oh, and there's lobster. 
Actually, this might be what I want to see. I really want to save these to go with our frog legs. I'll probably eat the rest. Yeah, let's eat the rest of the seed. Oh, here we go. This is actually super nice to know it's here. More berry bushes. Wobster den. Not far. Not close. Oh, and here we go. Here's what I needed to see too. There's more active berry bushes nearby. Because like five berry bushes that I don't have to um, worry currently about um, fertilizing is great. Because I still don't know if I know where the beefaloes are. I can also eat one of these probably too without too much sadness. Let's equip this. I'm going to try to get this one of these wobsters and that'll be our meal for the night if I can get them. Far cast. I don't know if they'll come this far. I might need to get a raft out there. I can't I can't really tell, but I'm gonna let them think about it. I might need one boat. I don't think I'm quite far enough over there. I don't think so. Okay. Let's go back home. Another berry. Oh no, I can equip the berry. I don't wanna attach it. Uh take this, take this off. Okay, head back home. We're making progress. Oh, and I, did, I didn't even know this one was here. I, I can't not take all this. Because I need to get my hunger back up. Yep. And there's a, a gobbler over here. No. Okay. Oh, we are farther from home than I thought to. I got enough straw to make a fire if I need to. Gotta go around here. Getting a bridge here could be nice, because, yeah, that's kind of an, like, very annoying amount of water if this is the area we're going to be traversing a lot. And eh, we might not need a torch. Eh, running into that tree does not help, though. But we should be... Uh, my torch is only at 4%, though. We'll keep it ready. <gasps> and we will... Just not make it. Okay. And we have rot here now. Oh, come on, come on. I can't build it. It won't let me. Oh, my. That's frustrating. I don't think we have anywhere on the map to even revive if I wanted to. Let's go back to the portal. Because I was trying to click it. I clicked the torch, but I had something in my hand so he wouldn't craft it. Oh, that's annoying. I don't know if this will revive me. By going back to the actual spawn. But I was enjoying this character a lot. Um, here's the... Yeah, no, it doesn't. Um, did we have a thingy magic? I don't think we've seen a, a revival thing. Nope. That's unfortunate. Very unfortunate. Yeah, there's no way I can find any way to get back. Just a misclick and a half. Ah. <sighs> I can wander around a bit, but unless I stumble upon a, um, uh, the lab, the touchstone, I think we're done. <sighs> I tried. Definitely my fault, though. What happens when you don't play the game a lot? 20 seconds. Find something important. Tiny touchstone. Walk past it, maybe? Ten. Nine. Nope, and look at all this nice area we didn't get to explore. We were really making progress today. <sighs> well. I guess, at the beginning of the next one, we will, um... Try her again. I was having a lot of fun there, but 
it is part of the course. I'm gonna go look at some different mods. See if I can figure out something that'll help us next time. But that's gonna do it for this episode, guys. Hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, hit the like button. Or subscribe if you want to see more. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.